Hey everybody, Richard Knives here, your favorite knife tuber, episode number 170. I got a Shatton Morgan that I want to show you. It's a sweet knife, like a flipping piece of jewelry. I ain't even kidding. And uh, let's take a look at it. This box right here, let's look at the box first. From Queen Cutlery Company, 19, uh, I'm sorry, 2006. Um, shows Titusville, Pennsylvania. This looks kind of like a stamp. It says Bradford Green Bone. Bradford Green Bone. Bradford Green Bone. Bradford Green Bone. says that. Shatton Morgan American Pocket Knives. This is a three and three quarter rail splitter moose. And it's a sweetie. There you go. So let's get the box out of the way and check out this thing. This is gorgeous. See the green bone on that is like popping right out the polish on it is legit she's got a little thickness to her and if you look at your centering right there good centering over here good and these blades they don't stick up too far and they're almost pinchable they're i wouldn't say well they're not almost pinchable they're a little slick. You got to use a nail nick. But here you go. Here's the spear. Look at that. You got the swedge. You got the long nail nick. The long pull. Beautiful. Here's the other side. This side says 2006. 42.163 model number I don't know if you can see that on there beautiful there's all kind of cars behind me it's like a, a male feller other people and clapped out vehiculars beautiful love the pull on it no half stop it's a cam tang let's check this one out the clip I ain't kidding you that is a nine and a half pull. That's a nail breaker, son. Shatton Morgan, one of 600. Look at your stamp right here. SH. It's got some kind of stuff there. I'm whacking the camera. Let's see if I can see it. There you go, Titusville. This thing, I'm not kidding, is like a work of art gator snap it's like a work of art like a piece of jewelry this is the most classy knife i probably have and this is a hundred percent gc quality this right here is like a tank brass liners brass pins none of them are proud none of them are sunk It is solid, and that ain't going nowhere. If you want a slip joint that's hard use, this is this is gonna get some work done. You got this choil right here. It's like a natural finger guard. Comfortable in hand. This is not digging into me, surprisingly. That'll do some work. Does need to be sharpened. It's not very, well, no, that is sharp. Son of a gun, I'll be dipped. That is sharp. It's a fingerprint magnet too. I promise you. Love the green bone on this. Listen. Woo! Just look at that jigging. Look at the character in that bone. Insane. Look at this side. A little more green on this side. The other side's a lot brown, some green. I'm digging that. Here's your back spring. Not a single gap anywhere to be found. Super flush. Look at that. Gorgeous. This is well put together. This is like one of the 
probably best put together knives I have. This is like a, man, it's quality. I don't even know what to compare it to. It's quality though. This was actually a gift from my buddy Jesse. And he was trying to get me into Shat and Morgan's. And he did give me one. That buddy is hard to open. No kidding. There's the UPS man driving down my driveway while I'm doing a video. My son got some Rockford Fosgate speakers. They're delivering them here. So, guys in a white Jeep Cherokee. Looks like you don't know what the heck's going on. No, that's a chick. I don't know. Let's get back to the video. Beautiful knife. Beautiful knife. Love the clip blade, the spear. I love it just as much. The spear is a little easier to handle coming out of there with your nail. It's got a really good point on it. See that? Actually, this one's a little more comfortable. I think it's because of that ramp on that clip blade. A little more comfortable while you're holding it. Just, this is classy. Look at this. Insanely classy. This is like, uh, I don't know, about as good as pocket knives get. It's got character. It's got a lot of shine to it. This is something to be proud of. This is, I'm super proud to own this. Just ridiculous. I can't even believe I own it. Look at that. Snap. And who gives gifts like this anyway? This is crazy. I'm just super thankful. Wow. Uh, happy to have this in the collection. Wanted to show it off. How could I not? You know what I'm saying? Also love these little details. Like, you see the jigging right here? Well, instead of having the transition right here on the bolsters or the caps, uh, they push those down, hammer those down so they match the jigging. So you can't even feel that. See? This side as well. Beautiful. This is uh, craftsmanship right here. Craftsmanship. Reminds me of like old timey pocket knife. And that's what GEC is doing now. Bill Howard was actually working uh, when this was put out. Uh, Bill Howard had a hand in this. You can tell. It's definitely every bit of GEC quality. Love me a Shatton Morgan. I really need to get me one of them new ones. They got uh, Cooper Cutlery, Shatton Morgan. They got Barlow's. They got all kind of knives. I need to get me a new one. Um, I don't know if they'll even come close to what this is. I'm assuming not, but I want to try one out anyway. Love this. Wanted to share it with you. If you're not subscribed subscribe it's that little red button right down there hey go to my instagram i got a very cool knife instagram and y'all are missing out if you ain't if you ain't following me it's richter underscore knives one of the best knife uh instagrams out there and i'm saying that about myself i usually don't but i like it i'd follow if i could I also like this if you like this shoot a comment down there what you think about this here knife sweet right all right, this is Richter, out.